Thanks for keeping an eye on the roads. The Naval Air Museum Barbers Point is celebrating 100 years and remembering 9-11 as well. And there's a free open house this weekend. That's where our very own Jill Kuramoto is standing by live. Good morning, Jill. Are you uh, being a dangerous maverick out there with all those jets there? <laughs> I'm trying to be careful out here, that's for sure. Thanks, Kenny. That's right. You know, the rich naval aviation history that's uh, out here at Barbers Point actually began in 1925 when the first naval aviator, Commander John Rogers, completed a trans-Pacific flight um, from San Francisco to Hawaii in a seaplane. So this weekend, they're celebrating the centennial anniversary with an open house and uh, a pretty big two-day celebration. And they're also marking it with a special remembrance ceremony on Sunday, September 11th. Now, here with us is Brad Hayes. He's the executive director of the Naval Air Museum here at Barbers Point and 100 years of flying yes. for the Coast Guard, and Navy Marines, Marines, Navies, yeah. and um, this is just a fraction of what we're going to see this weekend. Correct? Yes. So we've got fighter jets over here. Got fighter jets, uh, a couple A4s, a Huey, the Sea Stallion out there, the Sea King behind us. Um, we've got some aircraft from the Navy, Marines, and Coast Guard coming. Um, uh, the Hercules on the other side of the runway over there, and uh, the Dolphin are coming on Saturday, and um, should be fun. So just a lot of, and every one of these aircraft has a story. Like for yes. example, for those uh, that saw Top Gun, a big yes. Top Gun fan, that's actually a Viper's plane right there. That right? is that is the Viper airplane from the movie. Yeah. <laughs> Tom Skerritt. Tom Skerritt. Yeah. All right, and then over here we've got. Uh, actual combat vehicles the Huey yeah. here actually still has some bullet holes it actually has from... bullet patches on the uh a lot of them are on the right side of the aircraft uh i don't know why but i guess they got hosed from the right side um a lot of patches all over the aircraft and on the side and you can see them they're little patches and um then we got the sea stallion out there um which is the workhorse for the marine corps hauling uh, troops from ship ship to you know shore, mm -hmm. and, and then, then the Sea King here. The Sea King yes. here is uh, the presidential yes, helicopter. The presidential helicopter. And this is the same one that like the president would fly uh, in from the White House to Andrews, okay. and uh, he's got a bigger door actually, a right. one piece door. We have a two piece door. Oh, okay, yeah. okay. So same one with the astronauts. They yeah. pick up the astronauts in this, yeah, right? Yeah, the Apollo okay. astronauts. That's right. So cool. So I can do my presidential wave here. You could do your okay. presidential. Okay. All, right. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Come on in. So, um, tell us a little bit about what people, you, you know, people that may not know about the museum is that it's really just a. Uh, this a, is a, a, a compilation of just what. They, we what we they uh, specialize in naval aviation. Um, we don't do the Air Force or the Army. The only reason we have an Army helicopter over there, people are going to ask, is because they actually had Huey stationed here. Yeah. Um, but they. Come on in, Kevin. You can come on up, Kevin. <laughs> um, the, uh, the museum has uh, uh, a mission of, of displaying and preserving for Hawaii's uh, education purposes. And we're not really a tour attraction per se. We're here for school teachers. We're here for um, students. You know, so um, yeah, it's kind of so fun. It's hands on, and this weekend too. Yes. Everyone's invited to come on down, hands yep. on, feet on, uh, feet on, feet on, feet on, and, <laughs> feet on the rudder pedals, and, so. and a lot of fun. And it is free. It's open to the public. It's Saturday from ten to six, and Sunday from ten to four, with the remembrance ceremony starting at ten a.m. So come on down. Yep, please come down. All It'll right, be thanks, fun. thanks, Brad. Back to you. All right, it should be a great weekend. Jill Kermode reporting live from the Naval Air Museum, Barbers Point. Thank you very.